A high surf warning remains in effect across the rest of Southern California. So good evening to you. I'm Kathy Barrett. And I'm Michael Crowley. Colleen and Annabelle have the night off. Even though warnings are in place, some people say seeing the waves up close is actually worth it. This is footage out of Orange County. NBC4's Anastasia almost joins us live from Huntington Beach with more on this spectacle and the safety measures in place. Anastasia. Well, the biggest concerns out in Orange County this weekend are potential flooding in Sunset Beach, as well as these waves reaching Pacific Coast Highway in certain parts near Bolsa Chica State Park. I'll show you the waves right now. This is not too bad as we're seeing kind of the end of this swell. Uh, today, six to 10 feet high waves. Many people out just kind of watching still this amazing rare event. Um, and then we're expecting tomorrow a bigger swell to come tomorrow. I just had to get out here. It was looking back in. Just wanted to shred the gnar, get some sick ones. Excited to surf is an understatement for Caden Neighbor. Yesterday, I saw something I've never seen before. The waves were breaking past rubies. It was like crazy. There's a uh, white water coming in. You could catch like a minute and a half long wave if you call one all the way in. It is crazy. Even his dad is with him to capture it all on camera. Yeah, I'm just going to film him. Uh, I've taken him out here ever since he was five years old. It's the second day of the four day rare high surf in Huntington Beach. This video from an employee at the lifeguard headquarters shows flooding at high tide Friday morning. This is several yards from the ocean. She said it never floods that far, but some locals aren't too impressed. This isn't big. No, it's good. It's good size. It's perfect surfing but uh, not like they're talking about in Ventura and everything like that. Friday, lifeguards patrolled the waters for safety. The only people in the water seem to be the seasoned surfers. Hundreds of people walked to the Huntington Beach Pier to check out the massive waves, taking pictures and videos of the rare event. It only happens seasonally when you get a king tide, and it's pretty exciting. According to Huntington Beach City officials, this is the end of the first swell that brought waves about 10 to 15 feet, and Saturday we'll see a second swell with waves 15 to 18 feet. Which is pretty big for me, so I have that like pre-big surf adrenaline going right now. I'm just ready to get out there. The morning high tides are the biggest threat for potential flooding in Sunset Beach and anyone driving in the area tomorrow morning. Keep in mind these waves could come as far as PCH near Seapoint Avenue and Bolsa Chica State Beach. Now, as you can see, there are some people out there walking. This is the dog beach here in Huntington uh, Beach and no one in the water. So that's good news right now. Um, I would be remiss not to call out this beautiful sunset in Southern California. So good news out here right now. But lifeguards are also asking that if you're not an expert swimmer, please stay out of the water until January 1st. Reporting live here in Huntington Beach, I'm Anastasia Olmos, NBC4 News.